And this is Joe Friday and Jaeger back in Oklahoma City. This is Kelly. How long? Five minutes. Hi, Kelly. Hello. How are you? I'm good. How are y'all doing? Good morning. Good morning. I love Kelly Pickler. When we get to sit down with you, it's real. It's not professionally just very appropriate. Are you saying I ain't professional? Girl, you are fun. You're, <laughs> That's you're better. You is well, what you this are. is the first fun, time we sat down together. So you burped. I probably <laughs> so I did. We we're going to be like sisters after things. that. <laughs> yeah. No, but I, I don't want them to get to you and the groomers groom to the point where you're not real anymore because that's what we love about you. You're our small town girl in red high heels. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> or something like that. Thank you. In my combat boots today. <laughs> my butt oh, kicking good. boots. Well, let me see those again. Let me see. Those are coming back. You know, do people say the 80s Very are not nice. coming back. These are so we've had old. more had visits about fashion. Have you? So they're the original. They're the real deal. You know, it's like uh, when somebody tries to get pull 80s and it's revisited. No, no, no. I had those <laughs> back in the day. But then again, I'm older than you. But Kelly, how's it going? How's it been since you've been married and trying to combine with a massive career now that you're bigger than ever? Well, I um, I don't know about that, but I, uh, I did get married. I got hitched and we're still together. We're going to celebrate our well, very one. Very good. Yes. That's a plus. <laughs> hey, you, you never know these 72 days. days. 72 days did not. Uh, okay, good. Yep. good. We <laughs> actually are coming up on one year January 1st. So we're, <laughs> yeah, so, uh, which is exciting. We were last night trying to figure out what do we want to do for our one year anniversary and, and which is so weird to say because I've never said that before. I've never said anniversary. Not for me anyways, but I, uh. Yeah, I'm crazy about him. He's my best friend, and I love him more today than I did oh. yesterday. Um, got a new record that we we just finished, and I'm so excited about that. It, it um, comes out January 24th, and uh, I really can't wait for y'all to hear, hear the new music because uh, I've worked so hard on this, and it really is uh, it really is my, my heart and soul. It, this is the most special project that I've ever, ever been a part of and been able to work, work on, so can't wait for you to hear it well the fact that it is it sounds like you've got some real personal stuff in here too with the song tough some of us who have experienced i'm going to say similar situations and i am one of them um i hear that when i mean even watching the video we're going to get a bigger picture of what you know that relationship yeah that was out before we even got to have you as a household name we get to see it for ourselves. Yeah, I, um, I really, I really, honestly, the I guess the most difficult thing about making this record was, you know, I want to let people in because country music, the thing that makes it so special is that country music's about life. It's about real people and and uh, real things that people go through, the good and the bad, and. Uh, you know, how much do you want to let people in? How much do you want to tell? How much do you want to say? Because this is, you know, once it's out there, it's out there forever. And uh, there's one song in particular that I, um, I, well, there's two songs in particular that I kind of went back and forth on as far as, do I want to put this on there? Do I want to revisit this past forever? You know, because you sing these songs for the rest of your career mm -hmm. and you get asked about these songs in particular for the rest of your career and um, you know that there's a song on there that my husband and I wrote last Mother's Day it's called Mother's Day which is very very um, personal to me but I uh, was kind of skeptical as whether or not to put it on there because at the time I was just writing that song to 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 heal therapeutically yeah, yeah. in that particular moment um, being that we wrote it on Mother's Day, and you know, most people know somewhat the story, backstory on that. Um, that song wasn't written in specifically for the record. There's a song on there called "The Letter." It's a letter that I wrote to my dad, and uh, that again was not written in particular for the record. It was written um, in that particular moment to heal, and it just mm. happened to be, I guess the right thing was to put it on the record. It just felt right. And, and, uh, I guess the motives behind the songs were just to find closure. You know what I mean? So I, I, well, I think found that's its the place thing on that the record. I, I think that's the thing that I'm going to say that I noticed the most. Many of us put it on Facebook. 
as a status update when we're feeling it, but we get to, you know, maybe throw it out or delete it or take it back. But what you did, you're going to find that you probably reach a lot more people than you realize. Um, you're going to help a lot of folks I that have well, gone that's, through a similar that's situation. The goal. And it's therapeutic. Yeah, that's yep, the goal. It's therapeutic. Country music, of course, taking over 90210. How are you enjoying being on the show? I didn't tell them while I was there. I was like, y'all, y'all know that now I'm getting ready to turn this show red neck. We're going to bring it to Nashville <laughs> next time. We're going to change the zip code. <laughs> no, um, but, yeah, we're going to change the zip code. Um, but, no, I had so much fun doing that, y'all. I really I – did, I didn't know if I'd really like the whole acting thing and, and whatnot. And when you go into a situation like that, that's not my turf. You know, that's – I'm on their mm. – I'm on their – their stomping grounds. And you, you, like I said, you don't know what you're going to walk into. But luckily, everyone was so nice. They were so um, welcoming, and a lot of country people. There were a lot of uh, most of the lead, uh, the leads in the show are from Kentucky. There was some Carolina girls there. Met some people from Georgia, West Virginia. You know, there was a lot of country people there. Alabama. So I, um, yeah, I uh, and Oklahoma. I mean, many, many places actually. So I um, I really had a good time. So I really want to kind of, I really want to do it again. Actually. Explore that. A yeah, bit. I do. Oh, I do. Yeah. So. She's got the bug. I got a She's little got bit of the bug, bug, y'all. But I mean, this is I like what I want to do first: is my music. So if it interferes with my music, you, then I won't be able to do it. But <laughs> if it if it works out, then great. Well, we're glad everything's going great for you. Looking forward to the new work, and we hope to see you soon. Miss Kelly, have Thank a great you. time at the CMAs. Thank you all very much. It. Thank you so much. You I'll talk fun. to you all soon. Bye. Come see us soon. Will do. Love you all. You too.